Hello guys, how's it going? So I am back here with um tips and tricks episode. So today we will be going over the fountain, armor stands, uh, typewriter, and storage in library bookshelves. Um, so first off for the fountain, um, I'll show you how it works. So I, you can put items in the dispenser, shoot them off, and they'll f go flying. So let's go ahead and send a few items in here. We'll just do that like so. Now I have noticed that the, um, oops, if you're going to throw it in you have to throw it against the left wall. Though the fountain I have noticed is quite finicky sometimes. So every now and again a few items will pop out. And um, so let me go ahead and show you how to build this. So I will just get rid of these items. There we go. And then we will get all the materials we will need. Um, I haven't tried this out with normal ice yet, um, but I just use packed ice. So, first you want to get a 8 by 2 hole, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. You want to cover the floor right here with packed ice. Go ahead and come over here. You need two more packed ice, a fence with two glass on the side. Oops and then you need a another fence, you need the solid blocks on those sides. You come over here, put the water stream. Now if you want you can have the dispenser. Um, the thing seems less buggy when you have it and it will work more often. So I always go ahead and put that. And then if you want to hide your stream, you can go ahead and you just place carpet right on over. So you can just do like this. Um, you always want to have this block open in case you want to throw stuff in, and it seems to be glitchy if you have something over this block, so you may not want to do that. And there you go, you can go ahead and make a nice little design or whatever you want, and then you can throw your items in here, and you just send them off into the fountain. Okay, so now we're on to the typewriter. Um, this you can do part of it in survival and part of it in creative. So first you want this, go ahead and place a banner like that, and then you want to get a half slab. This is the survival portion of it, but if you want to go even farther, you can use this little command. Just pause the screen to see it, and you'll spawn a little lever right here. Now if you try and flick the lever, it'll just pop right off, so you do not want to flick it or... Like I said, it'll just come right off. Now, the next one is with armor stands, so I'll do a survival-friendly version and a creative version. So, if you want to get a nice version of your you or your friend, okay, let's do a comparison. So this is me right now. Um, so, I have red hair, creeper jacket, jeans, and gray boots, and diamond sword is the best tool, so I'll go ahead and do that. And then you can go ahead and see the comparison right here. Um, I would get the player skull, but I think there's a bug because the command isn't working the way I'm used to it working. Um, so I can't quite get the skull working yet. Um, to get it with the arms, you want to use this command. Um, go ahead and pause your screen if you want to type it up or something. And there you go. You do that command and you will get the arms. You could also do, if you want, um, I think it's show base plate, and you could do that false, I think, or, I'm probably doing that wrong, but anyways. So, survival friendly version, you can just get a pumpkin and the dyed armor. <laughs> of course, you can always just do the, and I broke it, <laughs> but you could also just do the cap like I had on the other one. Or you could just do a little pumpkin head if you want, because pumpkins are cool. They are. And now we move on to our final thing. It's the invisible storage. or are not necessarily invisible, but it is storage inside the little libraries. So we do this with a chest minecart. So you want to go ahead and set yourself up an area like this. You get a minecart. Now you want to push it slightly, break the rail, and then you come over here, push it right back in where it was, get your handy dandy piston out, put a bookshelf, and then you want to push this back, get a bookshelf on this side, 
flick the piston, go ahead and tear down your handiwork. Oopsies. And then you can push this in a bit more. And then I pushed it too far. Huh. So be careful when pushing it, because that can happen. And then you got your your little storage here. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more. And as always, I will see you guys later. Goodbye.